Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Jenna. If you're new here, please subscribe. In this video, I'll be sharing with you guys what's in my backpack for back to school 2023 slash school supplies. I'll continue watching. So let's get to it. So this is my backpack. Um going to school I never had like the brighter colors bag because they would get dirty easily and my mom would never allow me to like wear light colors bag like pink or whatever you know it's always the dark color bag because these get too dirty less in my bag let's start it's not heavy because the more you go higher in school I think the less your bag gets heavy when I just started out my bag was so heavy I would have to like leave some of my books at school because it was like required because the bags were so heavy so it's heavy this bag is from Exim Sports it's cute it looks cute Anyways, um, let's start what's in my bag. So, we're going to start by different areas. So, this here, right here in this little pocket area, I will have my charging port and my charging bank. It's really good. This came in clutch a few good times because my phone was dead and nobody wants dead phone at school like that's like the worst thing ever imagine being at school and your phone is dead it's like you are dead so make sure you have one of this my charging bank and then i'm gonna go inside this area this next big area and in this next big area i have one my comb to comb my hair i always travel with my comb because my hair easily gets messy especially if it's windy so always travel with my comb and then i have my pencil case here so this pencil case has been through a lot so in my pencil case i have quite a number of things maybe too much I have my markers of different colors and I have all kinds of markers. I have the big ones, the little ones, all kinds. And then I have some pencil crayons as well. A lot of pencil crayons and pens and pencils. And I also have these type of crayons. I don't know what these are. Crayons are called Crayola. I have the Crayolas also. And just a lot. This pencil case is so heavy. It's big. So, yeah, that's what I have. And also, also in this area, I have this little purse right here. So, this is where you keep like your money or whatever are important identification so my little purse I have it right here and then I have my body spray fragrance in my bag smells wonderful like the smell is something to get used to like to get used to it's something yeah so we're done with this area Now we're going to the big area of my bag. And also, I have in my bag is this soap. I have this soap that I bring. My own soap and I just spray it in my hands and I wash my hands. And then I also have my Ultra Shea Body Cream from Bath and Body Works. Yeah, and then I also must have 
my earphones. Cancel out all the noise. Like, what if I want to listen to the music or whatever? So we're going to enter the big part of my bag, which is where I keep almost everything. So, as I said, as you go higher in school, it requires less, like, less books, less stuff. Like, it's more easy. So, less books for me, thank God. So first I have this composition notebook. And then I have this Bendy's spiral notebook. Yeah. And um, then I have another Bendy spiral notebook. And then I have another composition notebook. So that's like four books. That's all I need. I don't need a lot. And I love the composition notebooks. I love these. And I also like the spiral bendy notebooks. But the thing with the spiral bendy notebooks for me is that it gets me confused sometimes. Because it's just so easy for me to rip the pages out. And I love doing that. So... I try to stick more to the composition because it doesn't really tempt me to do that. But the spiral notebooks, they tempt me to like rip the pages out. And I just want to rip everything out. And this is a three subject spiral notebook. So I have a lot of books. I don't need no more. But I love the spiral notebooks, but I just want to rip the pages out. Like I want to know if I'm the only one that rip the pages consistently out the spiral notebook. Because they're just so easy to do and I love it. Yeah, but I love the composition notebook some more. Yeah, these are these. That's that. Then I have my ruler. Always need a ruler in school because I cannot draw a straight line. I need something to trace with. So a ruler, of course. I don't really like these rulers. They're easily to break, I think. I like the metal rulers. Like, they're so metal that they can even cut you. And then I have pen plus gear erasers. I have two big erasers, and these will be gone in no second. I also have colored pencils, Crayola. I have plenty of these. Roller pencils. And I have a spring in my bag. In case you need a pop up, you can do it. You don't have to go to the nurse or get pills from anyone else. You have your own. And then I have glue sticks. This is a 12 pack washable emmer's glue but i don't think i'm gonna bring the entire pack but i'm just gonna like, take one out each time that i need so glue sticks glue sticks and then we're coming to an end with my it's not a lot in the back of my bag right here in this little section secured spot in the back i have my computer that we do a lot of work on every single day of the week. So I have my computer in the bag. Let's put that over here. And also in the back part of my bag, I have another set of colored pencils. I have a lot. This is new. And occasionally, to school, I may bring makeup sometimes. That's if, like, you want to do your makeup or you want to touch up your makeup. That's if you wear makeup. And I bring makeup. And I bring my foundation, my concealer, my highlighter, my mascara, setting powder, beauty blender, and a lipstick the gloss and I also have a face powder and a uh,
setting spray. I have a primer, LA Girl Pro Concealers too, and I also have an eyelash spoolie. Yeah, that's everything that's in my backpack for back to school. I love this backpack, it's so cute. And I love the color, everything about it is just so cute. It, to me, this backpack looks like it's going to take a long time to not be good again. It looks very strong and sturdy. So that's one thing I love about it too. Anyways, that's it for me from this video. I know this is probably the shortest What's My Backpack School Supplies video haul. So that's it for me. Thank you guys so much for watching my video. I love you guys so much. Make sure you subscribe, like this video, comment down below, and tell me what other video ideas you guys want to see on my channel. And yeah.